Welcome to MathsMaster.org. Let's learn about angles in a triangle. When we're talking about angles in a triangle, in terms of this angle rule, we're talking about the interior angles of the triangle, the three angles which are inside the triangle. And it's important to remember that this angle rule that we're about to learn works for any triangle, whether it's right-angled triangle, equilateral, isosceles or a scaling triangle, this angle rule works for all triangles. Okay, this angle rule is angles in a triangle add up to 180 degrees. So the three interior angles inside a triangle always add up to 180 degrees. Let's take a look at a couple of examples of how we can apply this angle rule to calculate missing angles or unknown angle sizes. In this diagram, I've got a triangle which has three interior angles. One is 70 degrees, one is 60 degrees, and there's an angle X which we are going to calculate the size of using this angle rule. So angles in a triangle add up to 180 degrees. So we know if we do 70, add 60, add x, that it must equal 180. Another way of thinking of that would be to say, start with that 180 degrees, which is the total. Take away the 70, take away the 60, and what we'd be left with would be angle x. So 180 take away 70, take away 60, is in fact 50 degrees. So angle X is 50 degrees. In this example, I've got a right angle triangle. You can see the interior angles of this triangle are a right angle, that's 90 degrees. There's a 50 degree angle, and then an angle with an unknown size, which I've called Y. And the purpose of this exercise is to calculate the size of angle Y. Well, angles in a triangle add up to 180 degrees. So we can say that 90 add 50 add Y must be equal to 180 degrees. Or, to put it another way, imagine if we start with that 180 degrees, we take away 90, take away the 50, what would be left with would be angle Y. So 180 take away 90 take away 50 is in fact 40. So angle Y is 40 degrees. That was angles in a triangle. If you want to see some more fabulous maths videos, please visit mathsmaster.org.